Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for October the 18th. Today in 1529, Cardinal Wolsey surrendered the great seal of his office back to Henry VIII. He was in the process of his fall. He was taking the blame for the long delay in Henry's marriage to Catherine of Aragon, not ending in a divorce or annulment. The papal legate, Cardinal Campeggio, whose name is so much fun to say, Campeggio, had arrived in 1528 to try the case in their marriage, which everyone except Catherine had hoped would end in a very quick resolution, but it did not. The Pope was unable to declare in Henry's favor because of the fact that Catherine's nephew, Emperor Charles V, was effectively holding him hostage. So Henry and Anne Boleyn were very upset about this, and they took their anger out on Wolsey. In October 1529, he was officially stripped of the office of Lord Chancellor. He was required to return the Great Seal. He tried to avoid any kind of indictment. He gave the king most of his property, including York Place, which is now Whitehall, and he retired to a small home in Surrey. York Place was to be renovated and given to Anne Boleyn then. In November, Wolsey begged the king for mercy, and Henry placated him and put Wolsey under his personal protection, but it would not last long. Soon Wolsey was accused of treason, he got sick, and died on his way to London for his trial in 1530. That's your Tudor Minute for today. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at englandcast.com. 